Coming up, I learn how to TikTok with a little help, of course. It's time to film it, slap it together, and call it a show. Call it a show. If this is your first time here, I'm Rob and I create story-driven comedy videos that shine a spotlight on people, businesses, and communities doing interesting things. So click that subscribe button, hit that bell, and come along with me as I dive into their worlds and share my experiences with you in a fun and entertaining way. My friend Lauren challenged me to create a TikTok account. To be honest, TikTok kind of scares me. But in the spirit of getting outside of my comfort zone, I decided to fully embrace the challenge. I jumped right into making my first video. I found the mask I wear. It's me you hear. I was up all night watching TikTok videos trying to crack the code. I even watched YouTube videos learning the popular TikTok dances, but I knew I couldn't do this on my own. So I reached out to the TikTok creator community for help and I got a great response. I met up virtually with a few TikTok experts in hopes they can share some advice on what makes a great TikTok video. What makes a good TikTok video is one that the audience immediately catches their eye. Very relatable content does well. Stuff that is so absurd and random. When I put a lot of effort into the videos, they don't seem to go very far. But when I put like 10 seconds into them, they seem to do a lot better. So I think you have to narrow down your niche. You know you're not like a young female dancer. Definitely not me. <laughs> Being yourself is the key to making a great TikTok and also finding finding your style, finding what suits you best and suits your personality best to let your personality shine. I think comedy is what you should try to stick to. Just do like a funny sketch every day or something different. Use your acting chops. Really like get into, get into it. They created this thing called the Hype House where there's all these American teenagers that live in this house and just make TikToks all day. And they've got so many followers, it's ridiculous. Do you think if I make good enough TikToks that they'll invite me to be the newest member of Hype House? <laughs> Why is that funny? Why are you laughing? If they did that, that would be insane. Their advice made me feel so much more confident as a TikTok creator. Without any hesitation, I dove right back into making some new TikTok videos. I had so much fun making these, and I was so excited to share what I came up with. So I held a Hollywood red carpet premiere to unveil my latest work and to get the team's thoughts before I upload it. I now present you the world premiere of my TikTok videos. There we go. Did you guys hear that? I never finished the game. <laughs> Rob, I think after seeing that, it's true. I think we can all agree that you're ready. Really? <laughs> you're ready. It's time. It all right. Time. Once I got the blessing from the team, I went ahead and uploaded my new TikTok videos. And within minutes, I had views, likes, comments, and follows to my profile. It was just really exciting to see it happen so quickly. And I'm so happy that my friend challenged me to make a TikTok account. At first, I thought TikTok was just a place to make videos, but instead I found a supportive community of creators. I made some new friends and I just found a place where I can be myself and have fun. I know this is just the start. My TikTok journey has only just begun. Hey guys, I wanted to share my quarantine routine with you. I wake up, then I shower, then I dance, then I dance, then I dance, then I dance, then I, dance, then I cry. <laughs>